Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the end of XCWC. This is uh, just an end of XCWC thank you video. Thank you to everyone who played and thank you to all of the mappers and all of that sort of stuff. And I'm just going to run through all the maps. You know, just gently take a run through, see where I get to on an easy casual run. Probably beat my server best from uh, the guide. And um, yeah, we're just gonna, I'm just going to monologue. It's been a great year. It's been an amazing year. We currently have about 450 players uh, recording this on the in midday on Sunday with about nine hours left on the clock for the final map. Um, yeah, thank you to Cool and VP for making this map. It was a wonderful start with some uh, dubious sections and a lot of routing. And God, it feels so long ago since we were playing this one. But it, it was a great map. Great map to start us off. We had some great battles. Saw some incredible reroutes. And uh, it's got some really nice secrets. And yeah, it kick, kicked us off really, really well. So that was fantastic. Uh, we're doing pretty well for the number of players that have played all the maps this year. Which is very, very cool. Uh, I've made a grave mistake. Never mind. Oh, come on. Let me in. There we go. Kool Aid Man. There he is. Phenomenal. So yeah, uh, this is probably going to be a bit of a longer, ramblier video. I'm just going to chat to myself. I've had a phenomenal XDWC so far. Uh, some really good results. Um, it's been pretty good. Go on, there we go. And... Yeah, uh, hopefully have some good results over the next few runs. And we'll see see what I've ended up with on map 5. This is actually quite difficult to do. Thank God for checkpoints. If I don't get it this time, I'm going... There we go. Cool! Um... Yeah, I don't really... Really know what to say else than that. Thank you to everyone who played. It's been really, really good seeing everyone who played. Um, playing through all these maps again is going to be a bit weird for me. Like I say, it's been a while. It's been a while. Let's see if I can make this jump. Yeah, look at that. Still got it. Still got it. Saved so much time that did. And the VP secret. Oop, I've pressed the wrong button. There's the V. Here's the P. And you get a vortex out of it, which is pretty cool. So yeah, this, this was a this was a good start. Good start. Dizzy took this one. Unfortunately, knowing that he wasn't going to be able to play at least one of the maps. So, the overall fight was going to have to come down to what Source could do to battle Goblin. And uh, still don't really know what's going on because I haven't been able to play it just yet. So yeah, I'm not looking at the results for map 5 because uh, I'm just very nervous about what's needed. There we go. Drop the waypoint here. Oh wow, first time into the fire link. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, 
going to be making a map using this. Oh yeah, uh, I should probably talk, it's, it's way far in, I should probably talk about uh, round six, that was the point of this. Round six, so I'm five minutes into this. Round six is a thing I'm doing. Um, that's not this one. Which one is it? It's the first one. There we go. Very potent, Kool-Aid, phenomenal. Um, yeah, so I'm going to be make, learning to make maps, is the plan. Learning to make maps. I have made a map, which I will show off at the end of this. Um, and I hope that some people might join me in making some cool maps for XDF. They don't have to be XDWC quality, they can just be whatever you want. Even if you just join, even if you just make the most basic map, because I made a very basic map to do this video yesterday. Um, and honestly, it was quite difficult. Um, yeah, the, the ability of people to do these sort of things is absolutely insane to me to build all of this and what cool's done with some of the incredible maps like i took a look at the map file for the map we just played xwc map one my god it's an incredibly detailed map file absolutely ludicrous that map file sorry to leave this map so early but obviously it doesn't have so many secrets so uh, yeah this map by freddy absolutely wonderful map it was hated, it was loved, it was then hated again, and I think a lot of people are coming back around to it because it's quite simple, and we've had some pretty difficult maps since. I know Source said yesterday that he did miss the simplicity and ease of... Uh, the, the ease of the routing on this map, that there wasn't too much to it, it was just what spacing did you want to get there, and how much speed could you bring through here, and stuff like that. And, uh, yeah. It, it's quite a simple map, but it, it also, it forced you to execute it really well. It was a really, really good map. I, I liked this map a lot. Very Freddy XCWC map, although we didn't see any of the ant holes get used in the end. Because of some ridiculous trickery. Map number three now. Uh, a map by Very Potent and Cool. And a map that got changed uh, in six hours by Cool. The entire route got rebuilt. A lot of people didn't like this map. I really struggled with it. But at the end of it, it was a phenomenal map. And yeah, it really was just a phenomenal map to play. So thank you to Cool for rebuilding this map. The original map is available. Uh, I think it will be posted on the Hardcore Parkour server potentially. Otherwise, it's on World Spawn, so you'll be able to do that. Desi's purple step, we must stop and admire, just for Des, because he's probably the only one that's going to watch the whole way through this video. Thank you to that, Des. Uh, I do appreciate people who watch this rambling crap. I do it for myself, though. There's the purple step. So thank you to the admins, especially Des. I'm now an admin, but you don't have to thank me for anything. Uh, I don't do a lot other than the videos. Hey, still a minute, that's not bad. Um, yeah, you don't have to thank me for a lot other than the videos. It's mostly Morrow, Mirio, and Des who do all of the setups. Morrow setting up all the servers, Mirio making sure everything really works, getting the maps. Of course the mappers, this one, yeah, VP and Fred, uh, VP slash Freddy. That, it's very confusing. VP's Discord name is Freddy. F Freddy isn't on Discord. It's very confusing for me. Is this the way? Oh no, this is the sideways. This is, oh no, it isn't. No. Okay, so this is one of the things. Uh, I'm not doing this because I couldn't, I tried, I couldn't do it. So we're just going to no clip it. Because I couldn't even get to this block here and then this is the hell of the jump. But here we go. All of the weapons. Including some beautiful tuba. And then there is another one, but I'm not in fact. Let's just go spec for it because it doesn't massively matter. I can't remember where it is either. This is quite an incredible thing. The difference between this map and the old map is absolutely mad. 
and just how many brushes and everything to make it look this good. It just, it, I love the look of this map. There we go, there's the very potent one. I, I do love the look of this map. Yeah, the, the secret entrance just being completely blacked out is so cool. But yeah, beautiful, beautiful map. Let's go to map four by J. Chite. A wonderful map again. This one had a lot of routing options that you wouldn't have thought about particularly. Um, you could go lower, you could go upper. I'm going to go upper because I know I can get up going this way. Come on, come on. Ah, oh, bollocks. There was also this where you could come round and somehow get round here fast enough to get some speed up. That was quite mad. Seeing people able to do that. Um, still not there. I should probably just drop a thing. It was a tricky map. It was a tricky map with some incredible, um, incredible sections. Come on. Uh, uh, press my button. No. Okay, here we go. I've got a flying button on X. There we go. JH. Up the back there. Then if we come down, let's take this route so we can take a look. Look at those. The author times, they were beaten. I didn't manage to get it at all, but the author times were beaten in the end. Great times. Great, great times. It was an incredible W only run. Um, yeah. This map flowed really nicely. It had some difficult bits. The slick was pretty well balanced. I have to say there were two runs in the top 20 that had um, that had the no slick route, this no slick route I've just taken. So incredible balancing to be able to make a slick route nearly work. That's it, it's rare to see. It's rare to see the slick route almost a uh, slick and non slick almost able to coexist in harmony. Incredible trickery from everybody round this corner that you'd come up here. Something I didn't know about was that you'd just... So I was going like that, but apparently the fast way was on top of this block and then you could get up to here rather than double jumping it. If you were going fast enough, you could go one and then you'd get a double jump off of this barrier. But what people were doing was off of that, on top of that... Let's just go... They were going off of that, they were going at stupid speeds, they were flying up here or over there, off of that and into the teleporter at that speed. They were then going through and doing a ridiculous set of very tight, straight, and getting 2000 speed to their absolutely incredible setup to do, you know, coming flying straight through into this finish. It was a majestic map. This map really had a good one. I'm glad I got a couple of people with the troll that I did in the preview. Rolling through these white things, making people think they were going to have to dodge them. Uh, and then confusing them when they jumped. This bit got a few people because this end is... Um, yeah, it's, it's that shape. But yeah, phenomenal map from JH. Really, really enjoyed it. Really, really enjoyed this one. Quite a lot. And now, the finale... Map number five. The secret's not yet shown. We start off, we've got Gerald. I've got to do this slowly because we are still playing this and I'd rather not get an incredible run. You go up here, you go up here, you get some speed. You fling yourself, it's got rockets, it's got slick. There's never a moment of stopping. Every other map this week, there's been some time where I could breathe. This map, there's just nothing, because if you're ever given a chance to breathe by your route, then you've got to clearly add something else into it. By the time you can breathe, you know, you're doing something else. In fact, I can breathe on that down ramp, so I should probably be firing myself downwards at it. If you can get 1850 uh, or so, or basically 1900, you can fling yourself all the way across there. You then come flying around here. You could do the rocket stack. In fact, we'll do that because that's the intended route. So the rocket stack is off there. One there. And one there. And I messed up the guide video with this one. And then you'd do that. And you'd come round here. Bounce off of there. And one up there. 
Or what most people are doing is down here, double jump off the rail, off the wall, up here. It saves you a rocket because you don't use one at the start. Then you get one to boost off the back there and then you still got one to gain yourself some speed. Fling it round here. Slick off the finish. I'm not quite sure what people are doing with the last rocket still. And then into the finish. But other than that, we've got grind for Gerald. We've got one secret per section, I do believe. So if we come round here, we come over here. We head down here. Okay, and then we pop pop our way marker just here and see if I can do this first time up here up here and then go and we're into the secret where we have the list of donations RRHP incredible people thank you to everyone who's donated to HP RR the regular servers there and the XDWC servers here. It is very much needed. The servers are fairly expensive to run for the month, uh, so it is very much appreciated. Live fast, die young, respawn, and try again. Uh, it's back out of here, back over here, through here. The next secret is this way. No, the next secret's after that bit. Hold on. Yeah, I do know where the next secret is. Yeah, there is. it's one per, and they're all quite far into the bit. I love being able to get that semi-consistent. Fortunately, I don't need to do it fast to get to the secret. I actually need to go the slower way to get to the secret. So that's good. The secret is off of here, up here, into here. And here we are. Last year's results. Dizzy, goblin, goblin, dizzy, goblin. Goblin taking it overall. Only two points in him at the end of round three. At uh, round four, sorry. Delta coming in third. All of the amazing people. We got 496 last year. 105 people, I believe, finished every map. But yeah, you can come and you are immortalized in history. Hope you don't change your name. Apologies if you do. <laughs> uh, yeah, you are immortalized in history having played these maps it is incredible seeing so many people i mean there's more than a hundred people genuinely playing these games because if you play every week then you know you can realistically be said to be definitely a player of these games but playing and then there's more people than that you know dizzy jh they're definitely xwc as mac mac riffo they haven't played every week uh for various reasons but yeah, it's pretty damn cool to see that many play players playing this niche arena FPS racing game. Here we go then, the final, final one. Quite difficult to get to because it's just right up on a step up. And then through here, on top of here. And flick yourself up and in. And here's where you get the tuba from. Where's my tuba? There it is. Ash, the mapper of this one. If I didn't mention, I'm not sure I did. Uh, yeah, wonderful, wonderful map by Ash. It's a beautiful map. It's got so much to it. Like, it really is an incredible map. Like I said, every time that you find something you can do... Every time you find that you're almost comfortable, you have to change yourself... And become uncomfortable again because it's it, it's faster to be uncomfortable you know it got to the point where i've had to release two videos on this map because i didn't know what i was doing from the start so that is pretty incredible really but yeah this map absolutely mad a mine layer you very rarely see it i've never seen an electro truly used inside of an xwc map uh, in fact, it's never been used in an XDWC map, but inside of a Xenotic map, I've never seen that used before at all. I think there's one in a Kota map, but it's not particularly um, special to being the Electro, whereas it, it really is there, like used as an Electro, as something only it can do, is kind of the thing here. 
that it's uh yeah you come around here free rocket again by the way um yeah this bit here just incredible because you can do one there then two here tends to be the way i think people are going for and yeah we, you just don't see so many of that sort of thing so thank you very very much i'm going to head over i'm going to quickly open up uh net radiant net radiant okay open a map no there it is let's take a look at my round six as it currently stands it will definitely get better than this but here we are Here's what I built in a couple of in it's it's far too small. Apparently, um, 128. Apparently, 600 units is not big enough. But yeah, you start here. There's a light source. There's a lot of cork. <laughs> there's a trigger. There's uh, two checkpoints. This is basically what it actually looks like in game. And there's a floor. And that is it. It's a very very simple map. It took me about. 40 minutes of losing my mind to build because this is not an intuitive piece of software and there's not too many guides for it. Sorry about the flickering if you've got that with the, the grids and everything. But yeah, it's it works. The map works and I compiled it. And then if we head back into Xenotic and we go to map one. Here is my map. It has two starts because I put the wrong number on the start. But you can complete it in around a second and a half. An incredible map, as you can tell. Nothing wrong with that. Hopefully you'll join me make some maps maybe next week. We'll see what goes on. Enjoy. Time off after XGWC if you're taking it. Thank you very, very much for playing. Thank you to Ash, Cool, VP, Freddy and JH for making maps this year. They've been incredible, uh, no matter how annoyed I got at them. Thank you to everyone who played. Thank you to everyone who's watched the streams. Thank you to everyone who watched the videos. Thank you to everyone who has competed, who's helped people, who's sent messages. If you've been part of this, it has been one of the best XDWCs going. We've done a phenomenal job this year. Thank you to the admins. Des, Mirio, Maro, Spike, Sinity technically me but you don't have to thank me too much it's been amazing this has been a long video of just rambling about random stuff i'm really proud of this map even though it's absolutely naff let's see if i can get a new pb hey there we go world record thank you for watching i will see you oh yeah you can just do this as well uh yeah i'll see you next video